All right. Good. Real quick, guys. Everyone can hear me? Let her finish. In your notes. In your notes, quickly. I want to just say a couple things. Number one thing, you're getting tougher. Yes or yes? Mimi? Uh-huh. Whitney, are you getting tougher? So, Colby, the other day, 40 minutes of phone calls. Four demos, 40 minutes. Boom, boom, boom. Easy. Nice job, Kenzie. I'll put you down. Okay. But and I wasn't even doing a good job. I was texting the whole time and listening to music and screwing up. Okay. And so sometimes I mean, like it's calls. sometimes it's gonna go that way, right? Like forty demos, four to forty demos, four demos, forty minutes, piece of cake. What was Colby's first hour? Pissed him off really bad. Okay. <laughs> Second I mean, hour. Thirty two calls. <laughs> thirty two calls in an hour. That's by the way. That's why he's gonna crush it. If you're not making twenty plus, then that's why you're not gonna crush it. But 30 calls is like crushing it. Does that make sense? You can't fail when you're making that many phone calls in an hour. So if you're dilly-dallying, you're probably, you probably are, right? But I'm telling you, you're learning how to be a good rep right now. I want to remind you, this is not about today. It's not about one day of the push. It's literally like a 21-day experience we're in right now. You guys understand that? Like we're, we're, we got a lot to go. We're just in the beginning, right? We're on the precipice. Because now what's going to happen is every morning, what's going to happen is every morning in the phone jam in the morning, you're like, shh, I got to book seven demos. I got an hour. And you'll get five or seven booked in an hour because of how hard you work today and how much you're going to like learn to love to hate the phone and hate to love the phone. And you're going to be like so in love with getting demos, you won't care about phone time. You're like, whatever, I got to do phone time. I just got to book seven demos. It's about the seven demos, not about, I'm too afraid to make phone calls. Right? So you're building skill. You're learning to be tough. And you're learning how to push yourself today. Does everyone understand that? And guess what? 21 more days of this. And not, not eight hour phone days, right? <laughs> but loud and fast. I've said this already to most of you, right? You got to be loud. You got to be fast on the phone. Like talk loud, talk fast. That is pumping enthusiasm into your approach. If you're just reading the approach and not being loud and fast, you're missing out. Does everyone understand that? Okay? Slide offs. So when they're sliding you off to Monday, sliding you off to Tuesday, I think I've covered this with everybody already once, but again, I want to say it. If they, if they say, they don't say no, but they push you off a couple of days, right? Say, great, this, this contest is really, really important to me. So when I call you Monday, can we make sure to set it for Tuesday? Can we set it up for Tuesday? Get some form of commitment as you hang up the phone call with that person. If I get like 17 texts. I hear like beeping every five seconds. Okay, sorry. It's a ghost. Okay, so slides. You guys clear with that? Next one is goal and a deadline. I really need this many by Wednesday. I would really not even like book Thursday. I want you to book Tuesday, Wednesday only. Have the attitude of like Wednesday night team meeting. I got to be at two grand. That means I got to book 15 demos, right? Or whatever it is, right? So book up and make it by Wednesday, by Wednesday, by Wednesday. Once you fill Tuesday, Wednesday, what will you do? You'll extend it, right? And that's fine. You'll extend it to, to, to Thursday, okay? Next thing is two times, three times. What is that? It's get two times with two or three thirty work. Oh, you can't do that? Oh, man, well, I really need 17 by Wednesday. So how about five or would 6.30 be better? Does everyone understand that? Look at me, right? So it's two times. Who cares about Colby? It's fine. He's, he's sold 50 grand. So what I'm saying is, look, this time or this time, that doesn't work. Repeat the goal. So really, these two go together. These two go together. You repeat the goal and the deadline again. In other words, just because you're busy during those two times, that doesn't change my goal. So my goal is still the same goal. So how about two other times? That way you're not being overly persistent or pushy. If those two times don't work, you're never going to ask for those two times ever again. You're just saying, I still need this many. So how about these, one of these two times? And if that doesn't work, what is it? Okay. So two more times. So you do it, do it again, what, the third time. And then the last thing is, I love it. Uh, ben got a demo with someone who just bought Wustaf. So awesome. I have all Cutco's ever made, right? Who got that one a second ago, right? And you say, great, then our appointment will be shorter. I promise I'll talk fast. So at 3 or 5.30 work, or 3 or 4.30 in other words, don't believe what they say. I'm never going to buy more Cutco because I've got everything Cutco makes. 
And that's ridiculous too. I just had someone call in. She goes, she has everything. And I was like, that's impossible because everything we made is in Olean still. Right? Does that make sense? <laughs> they haven't bought everything we make. And the thing I want to make, I, I said to her, and, and the funny thing is I, I said that to make her laugh. And she goes, yeah, she's buying eight table knives and getting a cheese knife for free. And I was like, oh, so obviously they buy, even if they say they have everything we make. Don't believe, because that will make you be less excited to set the demo. Does everyone understand that? You, you want to be as excited to set up that demo for sure as any other demo you set up. So make sure that you do not prejudge what they say on the phone and you just set the demo because I guarantee you go in their house when you're in a push period, you're going to be fired up, excited. You'll give a sick deal with bonus points and you're going to get a sale. Don't let them say, I'm not going to buy anything. I already saw Cutco. I Cutco, Cutco. I'm not in the box, not with the fox. going to buy Cutco. Right? Does everyone understand that? So those are just some simple takeaways. Any last takeaways? Good thing we don't work at a call center. Yeah, good thing. <laughs> don't. But that's the cool thing is you're learning, you're getting tougher. And the phone jams in the morning for an hour or two will be like, no sweat. You'll book five demos every time. By the way, leaders so far, uh, Becca's got seven set. Carter. Uh, Carter's got six. Yeah. And you're, your first half hour was rough. And now you have six. Yep. How does that make you feel? Awesome. It feels great, right? And then, Alex, you started, wait, where are you? I have six now. And Brianna's got five, and uh, Alex has six. So it's only been 90 minutes. So that's great, guys. Okay? So keep going.